The beauty pageant season has already bestowed many crowns this year. But there's a new show here in Gibraltar. And ten beautiful ladies are standing by to take the stage this Saturday night. In the very first Mrs. Gibraltar. As with all pageants, there's been plenty of hard work put in by all involved. And as the big night draws near, the final rehearsals and adjustments are in full swing. With all of the pageants here in Gibraltar, what is it that brought the girls to this show? We asked, why Mrs. Gibraltar? Uh, Mrs. Universe is a, is a pageant that has been happening um, since 2012. They always um, do the show supporting a charity and this year is domestic violence and the effects it has on the children. So basically it's beauty with a purpose. It was something that brings something good to the world. Well, first of all, I thought it was a fantastic idea, something new. Uh, it's a change of routine in life, so it's something different for me as well. Well, the pageants are aimed at younger girls and um, I think this pageant has given us the opportunity for older women, married women, who have their careers. That's, there's nothing like this ever in Gibraltar, so I think it's a very nice experience. For mothers as well, this has been my dream come true because I felt pregnant very young. I was 17 years old, so I couldn't join Miss Gibraltar. It's to raise awareness for different things as well, not just for yourself and having the honour of representing Gibraltar abroad at the Mrs Universe pageant, but also what it entails as far as women's concerned, being able to be a role model, to have other people look up to you. This competition is, uh, is not all about the beauty. This is a very good opportunity for those girls and ladies who is recently married and they want to celebrate it. I think this is a very good for women who want to do something different and want to make some difference for society along with their families. Since signing on for the show in March, the ladies have attended events and participated in lots of activities for their charities. We asked them, what have you been up to? Well, we've been doing a lot, actually. We've been so busy, we haven't even seen our partners, to be honest. No. We've been invited to lots of things, which has been really nice. Yeah. Like, we wasn't expecting to be invited to, you know, to anything, but we have. I'm made to feel special when we go there. Um, yeah. It's been really nice. Give us really confidence good well. Yeah, give us confidence. Yeah. Really good experience. Uh, we had drinks. Lots of drinks. Lots of drinks, <laughs> yeah, and we had a really nice time. We've done lunar walks, uh, charity walks around the Another rock. charity walk early on Saturday, which was um, great because we had a celebration on the Friday night for Mrs. Gibraltar. Yes. So we worked even harder walking around the rock in the heat. Yeah. I had an afternoon tea party up at the Wildlife Park. Um, raised a big chunk of money. It was for kids. We had bouncy castles, face painting, lots of things going on as well. So we've both been very busy. You just got to be yourself, didn't you? Yeah, <laughs> crazy. <laughs> With the big night only a few days away, we wanted to know how are you feeling? I think there are nerves kicking in now. On the night, there'll be that certain amount of adrenaline that will just get them, you know, performing at their best. It's a little bit hard, but it's very, very exciting at the same time, and I'm loving it. I'm loving it. It's been a great experience, and I would encourage anybody next year to join the pageant. Myself, I'm very satisfied with the feedback we've got, and I am very proud of all my ladies because they've done a really fantastic job. It's been a little bit of stress, but I, I think I'm safe for me to say that they've enjoyed themselves thoroughly. It's a different experience for them. And basically the winner here at Mrs Gibraltar will go and represent um, Mrs Gibraltar abroad internationally at the Mrs Universe pageant. The pageant will take place in Minsk in Belarus. I can assure them it's not going to be all fun and games, they're going to be working really hard there. But I, on the other hand, again, it's going to be a different experience and I really think they're going to enjoy it. The Mrs. Gibraltar show is on this Saturday night at 9 at the Inces Hall, with just a few seats remaining from Diamond Occasions. Mrs. Gibraltar! We wish all the contestants a great time and the best of luck. <laughs>